What is happening, Captain? This your boy CB Hunts, and look what brought down to my man cave today. We have here uh, the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse, the Detective Comics McFarlane C Collector's Editions, Red Hood. Man, when they said they was, this bag will come out, I had to pick. I had to pick this up because you know this version came for first. Before the main dude Joker. So, once we get back, we had this bad boy outside the box, and we will see what it do with a red hood. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Boy C. About to go on that spending spree. Cause I'll be looking for deals that my eyes can see. That government tell even has both sometimes more greens. How long it's been, yo? eBay, Amazon, even Big Bad. Equals the big three. And man, that's so sad, bro. And man, what's this shit in the show? New figs lifting my self interest. Is it on sale? It's lit. Oh, we no time to wait. Don't no procrastinate. Quality rates. Figures coming home with me like dates. Within the film, I'll be core figure poses with the law. And articulated form, I'm sick with it all, my lord, I miss the joy that the new toys brings, and I tell you all what's out, get my peeps a ring, I'm a collector of a sorts from this YouTube thing, I say what's happening, Captain, who's it for my crew to sing, so sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride, as you watch me support, hanging by my side, this is CB Hunt's Toy Channel Tour Guide. You see it's her packaging that McFarlane Toys has with his uh, McFarlane Collector's Edition, a little bit of a box, a little bit thicker on the side because we got the McFarlane Collector's Edition. Basically the same thing on the box. See the figure side, name at the bottom. All the stuff you see on the side. Same thing here. And on the back of the packaging, got a nice drawing of that of the infamous cover of the uh, Red Hood with the uh, classic Batman and Robin in the back. So, once we get back, we will have this bad boy inside the box, and we will see what it do with a red hood. And now, got this bad boy inside the box. Man, I really do like how this figure looks, but I know it's the same body as, I can't remember which version of the Joker, but of the, uh, of the three Joker line. I know it's the same body of that, just change different things. But we still gonna talk about the figure. But you know, before toys, they got the infamous black stand, got the little peg, got a DC logo, but this is more more of a, a silver look. And this is a DC line where I think most everybody has said this this right here is a stand to hold a card that don't really like it it's a nice idea but don't really like it could have used more use that same room for extra hands and hand sculpts or whatever or, or different different types of like weapons or whatever instead of, instead of adding this on there is is hollow holds the card up that's basically it and Speaking of the cards, got a card right here, like the image, same thing on the back of the packaging, this is the big father, uh, like, uh, like the cards, got a special type of like, words on the side, got, got a different type of loss on the card, and on the back of the packaging, packaging, back of the card, excuse me, uh, uh the Red Hood does has a bio, so if you want to read it, pause it. Here it goes. So, if you don't know by now, the infamous Joker first came out before he became Joker as the as the Red Hood, and new designs they had out. Back in the day, they showed a couple of comic book images. They're pretty clean, light. But then talk about his origins until a little bit later. I never, well, I didn't read too much on Red Hood, but I know he had like a few 
weapons. So this is where he came with the packaging. He does have a, a circle, almost like like almost like, like a like a ball peen, not ball peen, but like like a little hammer type type of uh, circle. It's all it's all silver, as you can see here. And he does have a handheld. A, a cross bow, all, all, all silver, silver colored, as you can see here. And now, for the main man himself, Red Hood. Like I said, I haven't a chance to get any of the three Jokers from, from that line, but I do. I do like this suit. They changed it up with like more of a, a, a black, a, a black patented type look with the uh, collar. See the shiny difference in the tie, white shirt in the background, all black suit. And I like the I like, I like the way the suit is like like a um, added color, but the collar was more shinier. I think the shoes as well, but not not quite, but it's not as shiny though. I do like the uh, cover buns at the bottom of the shoe. Look pretty neat. You got on the uh, all white gloves, as you can see here. And I do love the fact that McFarlane Toys has gone with the uh, with the uh, off capes. These are. Uh, Excellent addition. Got the sheen on this side. A little more of a, like a matte color. Other side, and it does has, and it does has a bendy wire in it. And love the red helmet. All one solid color. How he saw out of this, I don't know. <laughs> but does not have eye holes nor anything. But it does has that red hood type of a. Sh machine that Jason Todd has used after this I guess but it looked pretty pretty badass on that so just by saying well that we go with red hood articulation can't really look too much up and down on the red hood doesn't really move too much arms go up this high does have bicep swivel double elbows hinge and wrist no got a different waist with the Kind of, jank, kind of blocks it, does move at the waist, the splits, much kick, kick forward, kick back a lot. Has double knees, feet going, go back a little bit, forward a little bit, a little bit anchor rocker, and does has that toe hinge. Like I said, I ain't a chance to get the other jokers, a little bit of a tight of tight of exchange. To have one of the three jokers that it, that's like the same suit so it can have like the red hood with that one change still he still got the suit kind of change the colors wouldn't mind probably to see, see which one I can find or that but I do like the joker I have for my collection I do want to change it or the more new one that's probably coming out I kind of I kind of like it's out on it so I get a chance to order hopefully later on down the line I, I, I can't. And this is my review of the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse McFarlane, McFarlane Collector's Editions, The Detective Comics, Red Hood. Hope y'all enjoyed this review. Trust me, boy, the fun time making it. And you know, every review, I will take pictures. This is my Instagram right here, but I will leave links down below. You go and check those out. And your boy is on TikTok. While I take the same pictures, post over there. I just, uh, 
little bit of flair. This your boy, CB Hunts. Hope you have a blessed one. But trust me, I can't wait to catch you in that next one.